Pride and Premeditation, a book review by Christy Folsom. It is a truth universally acknowledged that a single man in possession of good fortune must be in want of a wife. Oh, drat. That's the wrong book. Uh, now, where did I put that new adaptation? Ah, here it is. It is a truth universally acknowledged that a brilliant idea conceived of and executed by a clever young woman must be claimed by a man. As we can see from the change in these famous opening lines, Pride and Prejudice has been given a new twist in Tears of Price's murder mystery retelling, Pride and Premeditation. In this version of events, we are trading in romance for adventure, swapping the bucolic countryside for the dirty streets of London, and following the exploits of a 16-year-old protagonist that is mostly the original Elizabeth Bennet we know and love, but with a bit of Sherlock Holmes, Elle Woods, and Ruth Bader Ginsburg thrown in for good luck. This Lizzie wants desperately to prove herself at her father's law firm, Longbourn and Sons. So when she hears of a scandalous society murder and an innocent man in jail, she jumps at the chance to solve the case. There are many obstacles and men that stand in her way, none quite so frustrating as the stern and prideful Mr. Darcy, a competing solicitor at Pemberley Associates Law Firm. But as the case twists and turns, Lizzie learns that she must rethink her own initial theories and put aside past prejudice, lest she become a murder victim herself. The archetypes of heroes and villains established for these characters in the original Austen novel are accentuated by Price's new adventurous setting. Plucky Detective Lizzie is a quintessential hero on a mission to defeat a dark and evil murderer. She is kind, determined, and morally just. We root for her as she faces trials, learns difficult lessons, and experiences moral dilemmas. Other characters from the novel become her villainous foes. But since this is a whodunit mystery, you'll just have to read the whole book to find out which villains from the original story are this retelling's big baddie. Reading Pride and Premeditation is a lovely chance to revisit this familiar tale with a new and exciting twist. The characters have been updated to be very relatable to a modern teen audience, and the pacing of Lizzie's sleuthing adventure really keeps the readers on their toes wanting more. One standout criticism is that the characters' behavior can be a bit unbelievable for Regency-era England. The author admits in her endnotes that she took liberties with historical accuracy to give Lizzie the ability to work outside the home, participate in law work, and bring a modern sense of feminism to the story. But this choice degraded the real struggles and limitations faced by 19th century women. A huge part of Jane Austen's Pride and Prejudice is in highlighting the ways that Regency laws and society stifled women and kept them stuck with few options and it is distracting to see these struggles treated so lightly in the retelling. But that being said, the novel does its job of being a fun, slightly dark, and twisty mystery adventure. Pride and Premeditation was written by Tears of Price. It takes place in 19th century London and is part of the Jane Austen Murder Mysteries series. Published by Harper Teen in 2020, the first edition has 360 pages and a cost of 1150. Of course, it is a truth universally acknowledged that one need not pay 1150 for it. Hurry to your local library to get a free copy of Pride and Premeditation today.